back with a new video. And since it's summertime, we are both going on vacation this weekend. We all know that struggle when you can't fit anything in your suitcase and you just get so overwhelmed. And it's so annoying when you don't have any clue about what to do on the airplane and you can't stand up for anything and you're just so antsy and anxious. It's terrible. So today we'll be making a video about tips and tricks about how to travel like, like a, a pro. pro. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and let's, let's get on with, with the video. Tip number one. If you tend to overpack like we do, a really good tip is to start to roll your clothes in sections of your outfits. To roll your clothes, just take a pair of shorts or a shirt and fold it and roll it up like how you would roll, I don't know, a paper towel or something. And then you can place it in outfits and I rewear my shorts at least once or twice and so I do two shirts to one pair so it could start to look like that. suitcases at baggage, baggage claim when all of them are coming around you know it's yours with a ribbon and it's also nice to have tags that have all your information just in case if your suitcase got, ever got lost it would be super nice just so it make just sure to have right stuff to that personalizes your suitcase so that people don't grab it thinking that's theirs my suitcase it's not as much big of a deal for the ribbons and stuff because I have a Chevron suitcase and I don't think that there's that many of those so, just make sure to personalize your suitcase in any shape or form. Tip number five. The next tip is to bring a toiletry bag, and a lot of you probably already know this, but just to make sure that you guys don't just like throw in a thing of shampoo or something because it could easily spill. Tip number six. Tip number six is to, when you add shoes to your bag to make sure they don't get all dirty all over your clothes. So to put them together and place them carefully in your bag so none of your clothes get dirty. Tip number seven. A really great tip is I love bringing ball caps to like the beach or if you're going to like the desert or a really sunny place. And a really good tip is to stuff all your undergarment in the hat and then you can place it in your hat so your hat does not get all smushed. Tip number eight. 
A really good tip is to bring an empty water bottle that has nothing in it to fill up at a water fountain once you get past security because you can't bring anything larger than three ounces past the security check. And this is also good because it gets super duper duper expensive, especially when you're on vacation or something. You can just fill it up at your local stop and just put it in like one of your beach bags so before you go to the beach you can just fill it up.